Grandfather was crossing the road one night, trying to get home and uh, watch my oldest brother play footy. And uh, he was just struck by a car that was going a bit over the speed limit. And my grandfather died that night. So. Um, yeah, my dad was in the passenger seat and uh, obviously his mate was drink driving and uh, had a crash and killed my dad, so uh, it's not a yeah, good feeling. My mate was out and he um, got into a car and uh, with a drink driver. Someone walked out onto the road and he lost his life on, on McMillan's Road. Full drive rollover crash, rolled a few times and my cousin said he found Dad at the back seat and yeah, it's pretty, pretty sad. Obviously alcohol and driving doesn't mix and unfortunately for, uh, for my family, he lost one of our cousins. That's one of those things that never goes away, the pain's always there for, for the family members. It's stupid and it's a stupid thing to do. So you're not only putting yourself in danger but others as well. Causing death and it's not their life, it's other people's lives as well, so. It's the people around you, you know, your friends and your family, and it's something that's easy avoidable. Keep your mates safe and keep your family and friends safe. You know, you've got to make the right decisions and think before you drink. I think if you want to become something, and um, anyone can become anything in their life, it's those little decisions along the way, like drink driving and not doing it, that are going to help you achieve that. So easy to stop, and we, sh we should be stopping it.